trick that can be used on the sharp fryer. Now I've had um, some people tell me that these are hard to prime when you when you mod them. Yeah, there is. You don't have anything like pull on anymore. Um, obviously, if you look at the whole top of that, there it is. Now this is the um, the second prototype of of the sharp fryer that I have. This is the old The Only real indication externally without opening the breech that this is in fact got balls is the PETG countersink all the way to the barrel right in the front. So the barrel on this is is, is all of that, as you can tell. Um, the next one will have it all the way out. The ones in the kits will have it all the way out. I'm finding that the more barrel you can take advantage of, the better. So here's a trick in priming the sharp fire. If you have more than, I'd say, 8 kilograms. Um, this is right here. This is 18 kilograms. And for all practical purposes, that's about as powerful as you can get. You're limited by two things. One, you're limited by this right here. It can break off from the bolt. And the other problem is you really have no place to hold on to it to have a significant yield. So here's what you do. You take your two fingers here and here, and then you have your, your palm right, right on top of here. Okay, so like this. You pull on it, and then you take your palm, we have it open. Let's see if you can see that. See that? And you just, that. So let me do it slowly. Now, oh, and as you can see, um, yeah. she's got balls. Okay? She's got, a, she's got a brass breech in there. So. Let me, um, let me do that again. Again. So like to the back here, with my hands. Their hands might be different. Back here, you basically pull it like so. That's slow. That way, what you're doing is you're taking your hand, you're using it in a cyclic motion to prime it back. What someone really has to do is, I think, probably put a big knob so it just goes clack, open, clack, shut. Even though it wouldn't look as as nice. Ooh, I missed a towel. Okay, hold on a second. So, quick succession. Slow three shots. Okay, with with this with this action, I did this for yield, but also speed. Watch. Ready, go. So you can load real quick if you got that action down, just like that. If you got that whole thing down, you can do that. All right. Well, this is Chris Cartea, signing off.